And here I am, uh, all worked up here to level 10, HP 90, MP 20, uh, with 97 gold, uh, look at all that experience, um, doesn't really show any of the good stats here though, uh, but, uh, so I did, uh, get quite a few items here, uh, got some potions too, uh, almost maxed out on, uh, potion ones. You can only hold nine of each item in this game. It kind of makes it annoying. Uh, do you have B power, B protect, antidote, and then uh, medical herbs, I believe. Uh, and then the rest is up in uh, jewelry. The topaz is 500. Um, opals are 100. And then uh, pearls, I believe, are 200. All right, so we are going to be moving out to the east. Uh, I will be cutting out the battles here because they are just tedious at this point. Um, I can take everything out with one shot unless I miss. Oh, but I did make it into the dungeon, no problem. Alright, so I'm going uh, just uh, around to the back here. I do my, know my way around this dungeon quite well now uh, after doing it a couple times. Those yellow dots there are uh, treasure chests. I will be getting every single one that I remember. I should remember all of them since I do know this map well now. And the first one here... Oh. I will not be cutting this out because we do have a new enemy. This is a... Oh man, I already forgot the name, but I'm pretty sure it shouldn't be too much of a hassle for me. Oh, it's called a statue. Uh, there are two new enemies here. Uh, once again, you only face one at a time almost every time you face it. Uh, and I got a sword that I can't use, so I'll be selling that. Uh, the encounter rate in here gets pretty high, I'm actually pretty surprised. How often I have been avoiding it? Is this the other enemy? Yes, it is. Uh, this is a Chimera. Uh, that is an HP catcher move. Um, oh, I never showed you my spells. I did learn a couple magic spells for Necro here. Um, a fire one, basic fire spell. It does about as much damage as a regular attack, so I never use it. An HP catcher, which is uh, kind of an HP absorb, you know, I do damage and get that damage back in health. And a firebird, but uh, as you can see, that's almost, that's over half of my total MP, so I rarely will use that. Uh, so let's continue on in the dungeon, going for the other treasure. I'm gonna take on Ramus, a killer dog, I believe they said it was. Um, of all things, uh, the, our first boss would be a dog. Ugh. It could always be worse, but I, no, I don't want to take on a, a dog first. And uh, continuing to go on, just chimeras and statues in this entire dungeon. So the crystal ball does come in handy when I'm looking for treasure. But it hardly ever comes up in terms of uh, avoiding random battles, which is what I think it was. And in here we have a topaz that is worth 500 gold, gill, whatever you want to call it. And that's where that battle proves uh, that once again I don't like how only have being able to carry nine of each item at a time. I didn't actually buy any potion ones uh, since that first time in that first town, um, but I keep on winning them from. Uh, from battles and but I, I don't lose any HP. I'll only occasionally take a hit when there are two enemies uh, on the field at the same time uh, but that rarely happens so I'll, I'll end up using a uh, potion when there's only uh, two HP to be healed or so and I don't like using that and I went the wrong way. One thing I wish the crystal ball would tell me is where the door is that's really the most important thing here. But unfortunately, just monsters and treasures. I believe it's down here. I need to find the stairs. And like I said, the encounter rate is high, so you have to forgive me if I do make a lot of edits in this one here. I can't go up the side of the stairs? Come on. Alright. Trying to remember which floor this is. Um, oh, this floor. Um, the left and the right door just loop around the back to each other, so there's really only one place to go. 
go. Normally I would say this goes to a boss fight. You know, an empty room like that, but no, it's just another floor. And the first time I went through this floor here, um, I actually missed this altogether. If you look up here, it doesn't look like you can actually go down through this, but you can. And it is the only way to get to the treasure chest here, and there are two here. So you can see on the crystal ball. And I got a pea seed that is a power seed. I'll be using that right. Really, game? Really? Alright, I'll be using that power seed now. It raises uh, your attack straight from 1 uh, to 4 points up. Uh, let's see what I get here. Come on! Big number, big number, no whammies. 3 up. That will do. Alright, going to the other treasure chest here. Alright, come on. Don't hit me, don't hit me. Oh, you are just cruel, game. Uh, that battle, um, actually the Chimera ran away from me. And I can't even get this... Anyways, so here I'll show you guys. Item, potion one, nine. Use it. I healed three. Three HP. So, can I have it? Thank you. Alright, now I'll be going all the way around again. So to all the way to the other side. You may be wondering at this point, uh, Father Scuba, uh, you can call me Steve, it's cool. Scuba Steve, come on, somebody's got to pick up that reference. Alright, uh, why are you so overleveled at this point in the game? Well, it, I actually haven't beaten this boss yet. I got to the boss and that's when I found out that it wasn't recording in-game sound. And uh, all the guides said that even though I could, like I was saying, even though I could beat these enemies at level 5, I wouldn't be able to beat the boss until level 10 and I do not feel like dying. Apparently if I die against this boss he gives me some kind of dog whistle, but I didn't really want to do that. I want, if I'm going to be leveling, I might as well level up early in the game. Another potion one. Alright, how much can I heal this guy? Let's see, potion one. Another three. Search. I got the potion. Come on, can I just have ten? And I'm apparently overleveled enough to have uh, the enemies run away from me on a pretty regular basis now. So yeah, my name is Steven, and um, hope that doesn't you know, give out too much information. So if you want to call me Steve, Scuba Steve, Steven, doesn't really matter. I answer to anything said my way. While I'm on the subject of personal things, I actually got jury duty uh, coming I don't know how it works where you guys come from, but uh, here uh, I have to make phone calls in about a... Uh, in a month and a half or so. I uh, have to call the number every night for, I believe, three nights. And if uh, they call my group, uh, then I have to report for jury duty the next day. It's a lot of fun. Uh, I already had to do it once. Um, I actually didn't get selected. Uh, they didn't even get to uh, ask me any questions. Uh, they just uh, ended up selecting all 12 jurors before they called me up, so I got out of there no problem. So I pretty much uh, got half a day off that day, so I'm kind of looking forward to that, but I don't want to be a juror if at all possible. Alright, this um, this looks like a boss if you tell me, so go, go ahead and you know, use one of my potions, heal up a, a minimal amount of 1 HP there but as well. Uh, so here we go, fighting Romus. Uh, that apparently is a dog uh, swirling around me like that. So let's go ahead and talk to him. And like a good dog, he growls at me. And here we go into the boss fight. That is one tough looking boss. Let's see. Um, let's go ahead and put a B protect on me that doubles my defense. Let's see how much defense I have. 50 defense up, so now I'm up to 100 it should be, and he misses with his AP capture move. So I go for the, on the attack, I do 20 points, 2 damage. He did 2 damage to me? Why did I do all that grinding? Like, seriously. Alright, let's go ahead and put a uh, beat power on me, that doubles my power. Let's just get this over with. This guy seems to be a wimp. 
Oh, he did take 14 away. But let's see how much I do now. 65 damage. Oh, this there. That didn't work. <laughs> Even your leech life. How do you miss with lightning? Not too difficult here. This is uh, pretty, pretty basic here. I don't need. Oh, and there he goes. I didn't even need to heal, but I get 520 experience, 240 gold. That's insane for this boss. And my cr the curse of Romish is gone. It's gone. What the hell was that? Is that my victory music? What is with the music in this game? Alright, so I found the key of Earth. And my crystal ball is gone. Uh, there don't appear to be any monsters left in the castle. So I will meet you guys back outside. <laughs> Unless you guys want to watch me walk. Yeah, I didn't think so. Alright, see you there.